What up, people? Art and Benny back at you with yet another video, man. I'm in here chilling with Tigger. You know, about to put another mod on the car, man. About to put another mod. And this is gonna be a mod I'm doing myself right here in the authentic garage. Weezy, I For the people who just tuning in, here they go right here, man. The orange with the silver splashes on it. There you go, man. I think this is gonna be a real nice touch to the interior of the car because as you know, I'm going with the orange accents all over my car. And in the interior, you got silver, everything, all over the car. Even the old paddle shifters are silver. So, basically, by adding this, that's just gonna be a real good accent. You know, as you can see, boom, boom, go good with everything. I, did, I didn't wanna just get like an orange with, with F8 or something like that, because as you know, you can't see no F8 while you're inside the car, so I want everything to flow all together while I'm inside. Uh, later on down the line, I want to go ahead and uh, do something with this. I hadn't made up my mind what I want to do with it yet, but it's just bare minimum. It's still stock, you know, everything other than this button. But uh, basically, I want to do something with the knobs, you know, fix everything up. Maybe like the cup holders, you know. I definitely want to add some uh, some color to this, and maybe get the 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 uh, the thing, whatever the thing is, get that painted. Get started with this install. I'm show y'all how to do that. Now I've seen a lot of people take the whole horn off. I'm talking about took the whole horn off, buttons and everything to get to where the pedal shifters are. But I'm thinking that you can access it from the back because on these screws right here, if you look at this one, this is without the cover. You got two screws like right there. I'm thinking if I take these two screws out, just the pedal, sh the pedal itself will come out. So that's what it's looking like here. I'm take this cover off and see what we got, but it should be the same. It should come off easy. So, we're going to see. That was quick and easy. So, as you see, that came off pretty easy. And it is the same with the two screws, so it should be easy to take off.
It hurt by itself? Huh? It hurt by itself? Yeah. I didn't get it. So as you can see, that quick, man. I just finished one of them. Check it out. That's how it's looking. Before and after. As you can see, man, that thing looking good, bro. So far, so good. It's looking clean. It stands out just the right amount. And I like the height of them, too. As opposed to this, I mean, it's nice for what it is until you see this, man. This is like, this is like hard, man, for real. Time to get on with the next one. And just like that, man, we got the thing in, we got the thing done. Check it out. As you can see, it was real, real easy, real, real simple to put in. Each one only got two screws in the back. Basically just pop the cover off, take the two screws off. There's a little plastic grommet that goes in and then the screws go on top of that. Uh, for the tools, the only thing you need is a flathead. You might need a little smaller flathead than this, but I made it work, you know? You need a flathead and a torx bit. The size torx is TR7, as you can see right there. Boom, you can get this easy on Amazon, but that's all you need to get the job done, you know? Give y'all a little close up on that. Got the orange and it's real, real glossed out too. You can see the plus symbol up in there. This is OEM Hellcat pedal shifters too so boom let y'all get a back view see how that thing look looking real glossy you know real real glossy it's got like the same amount of click too that's OEM see this side the attention to detail man you can't see nowhere where the paint starts or stops it's like glossed out perfectly Whew. man these things so smooth bro I swear i like them they stand out a whole whole lot man if you're not messing with rhino code on instagram holler at them asap i'm telling you man tell them authentic Benny sent you there you got to get some of this what up b you doing the drive-by what you doing All right, V, do your thing. <laughs> I can go fast. Oh, basically, uh, like I said, I'm gonna change out all the stuff in the interior eventually, little by little. I got some plans for, you know, the upper regions too, so I'm, I'll let y'all know about that a little later on, but yeah, B. Let y'all know about that a little later on, but go ahead and test them out. Everything is working good, man. I wanted to show y'all real quick how this thing looking at daylight. Just give y'all a quick glimpse, you know. That's how you looking when you rolling, you know. That's how you looking, baby. 
I think it's pretty hard, man. C nice custom work. Now when I add these other pieces up in here, that's gonna just tie everything together, man. Y'all just stick around and wait and see what we gonna do to this interior, man. It's gonna be raw, it's gonna be sick, it's gonna be authentic, for real, for real. Trap, trap money, penny. Stick around for more content. Follow the uh, personal page, Authentic Penny. Follow the car page, Authentic underscore scat. Follow the dog page, man. Yeah, I said it. The dog page. I'm telling you, it's some big, big things coming, man. I pride myself on being multifaceted, coming at you from all angles, being unpredictable. Like, that's the way my, my mind is always thinking, always searching for new things and to grow, you know, so the dog page is authentic dot at authentic dot Frenchies. look me up on IG, make sure you follow that page, big big things coming, of course I'm gonna bring that content over to the channel also, but I'll also have the cold pics, cold videos, you know get everything first on IG most of the time so y'all make sure y'all go ahead and follow that page too man authentic Benny